so welcome to part two of my video series, Speed Bag Basics. Uh, hopefully you've watched part one. Uh, if you haven't, you can click right here. You can check that out. Basically, part one covers the basics on how to hit a speed bag basic rhythm, uh, getting started with it. Uh, this is part two, so I'll be introducing two new things. Uh, one is a different way to hit the speed bag. Uh, in part one, we showed the back of the hand, the basic rhythm. Now we'll be adding some knuckles and we'll be combining that with the back of the hand, uh, basically how to transition between the two when using them both together. Uh, next, I'll be introducing basic footwork that I personally like to use during the speed bag. I know people have different versions they use with including footwork, so I'll go over a couple different topics with that, but basically the basic rhythm in boxing and using the speed bag. So having said that, let's get started. All right, so here's just a quick review of what we learned in part one of the video series. Uh, this is just a basic triplet rhythm. You're hitting with the back of the hand, allowing it to bounce three times, and just getting in a smooth rhythm, nice circular motion with your hand. Uh, in this series, we're going to be learning how to connect with the knuckle and then bring it back around to connect with the back of your hand. So as you see me doing here, I connect with my knuckle, bounces once, twice, three times, bring my arm around, connect with the back of the hand. So again, slower. Connect with the knuckle, bounces in that triplet rhythm, bring my arm around in a circular motion, connect with the back of the hand. So here I am in a little normal speed. Uh, again, knuckle, back of the hand, knuckle, back of the hand. You're keeping with that triplet rhythm, but this is a good trick to utilize, especially when you want to switch sides, when you want to switch from your right hand to your left hand. Here it is in a little slow motion. I connect my left knuckle, back of the hand, and I switch over right knuckle, back of the hand. Left, left right right but it's still that triplet rhythm it bounces one two three one two three one two three and as i said this is a good trick to you can tr can transition from side to side now here it is in a little faster motion and you can see at a faster speed you combine the two tricks that we learned in part one and part two and you can use this to switch from side to side right right left left there you go Switch the side to side is a good transitioning trick. And here it is, a little faster speed again. It also, when you connect with that straight punch, it speeds up the bag. So this is a good way to really get a fast speed going with the bag. Now also, as I said, we will be covering some basic footwork you can utilize with the speed bag. Now I'm not going to be going in too in depth on the basic footwork of boxing, but as you can see here. The basics of boxing is you always want balance. Your feet are a little bit wider than shoulder width. And some people train with the speed bag in their basic stance. Now if you're right hand and your left foot's in front, right foot's in the back. If you're, if you're a southpaw, you obviously your right foot's in front, left foot's in the back. So here I am, I'm in an orthodox stance, left foot's in front. And I'm just shifting my weight as I connect with my left hand. I push off the right foot, shift my weight to the left foot. Not too much, just slightly as you don't want to be off balance and then as I connect with my right hand I push off my left foot shift my weight slightly to my right foot now here I am in the south pole stance it's the same principle you're just in the opposite stance now if you're a fighter and you want to train in your stance you know that's perfectly fine if you're someone who's just generally interested in hitting the speed bag for fitness and you know just a little skills training um, I wouldn't you know say that in a certain stance is, is a must you know you can stand in either stance or even as I'll show you in a little bit you can have your feet parallel but again the basics is you want to stay on your toes and it's just shifting that weight from left to right now here I go my feet are parallel uh, this is how most people I would say hit the speed bag but again you stay on your toes and you get in a rhythm it's all about rhythm so as I connect my right hand I shift my weight to my right foot push off the left and as I hit with my left hand, I push off the right foot, shift my weight to the left. Only slightly though, as you don't want to put too much weight on either foot and be off balance. And that's what I believe is a basic footwork. Again, the speed bag is all about rhythm. You just want to get a nice rhythm. You can stay on your toes, get a nice bounce going, shift your weight right to left. And, you know, that's, again, it's just the basics. What I believe is a basic fo footwork you can get into with the speed bag. All right, so that's the end of part two. Hope you enjoyed it. So, during part one and part two, we basically covered all the basics. All right, part one, we showed the basic triplet rhythm, how to get started, uh, basically how to just get used to that rhythm using the back of your hand, the basic motion, uh, the circular motion of your arm. Part two, like we 
that we just covered. Uh, I showed you how to introduce a knuckle, then come back, back in hand. How to switch sides, how to stay with that rhythm, switching side to side, uh, how to join the two together. Um, also, we introduced some footwork drills, uh, how to get the basic rhythm of your feet going. Uh, so that basically covers all the basics you need to know to get started. So from now on, part three, part four, I'm going to be introducing some neat tricks you can do with the bag, basically how to get more creative with it, some more rhythm drills we can use. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit the like button and uh, please subscribe because there will be plenty more parts of this series coming.